there guys hello there how are you okay guys divine father mother ancestor spirit guides of the most high please surround us enfold us and protect us with your light anyone sending any spell work evil eye or negative intentions towards us please send it back with full forgiveness thank you change on mic will you please protect us this time thank you okay guys so what i'm picking up here is the name Ashley or Ashlyn, okay? Um, also, I usually wear something over my head when I go outside, especially at night, okay? I even turn the light out at, at night when I go outside because of, like, any bugs or whatever, the flying ones. And monitoring spirits is a real thing, and they use bugs, okay? They use bugs and people and other things. Um... If you see cockroaches and you usually don't have them, if you see gnats and stuff like that, that's monitoring spirits. If this is not usual, okay? Sometimes they'll be bigger than normal, okay? Things like that. I went outside, forgot I didn't have a hat on, and right away, here comes a bug. I mean, it was close to getting in my ear. Let me tell you, I've had it happen before, and... This bug did whatever it had to to get into my ear. I couldn't believe it was able to get in my ear, but it did. So, I didn't want this to happen again, and when I felt it around my ear, I was freaking out, and I ran inside, and I said, no, mm -mm, not again. Last time, they had to put lidocaine in my ear at the hospital to uh, put it to sleep. So, let me tell you. They will do what they can to try to make your life miserable. But they're going to use fear. Let go of fear, okay? Monitoring spirits. I was told to use my cards, okay, guys? Um, I still haven't finished them yet. So, the best I have right now, but they're my cards, okay? Let go of fear. And also, something about a hidden trail. So you may have found a hidden trail, <clears throat> is what I'm getting here. Now, these people do not want us to reach our fullest potential. And I'm going to be talking about this a lot this week. They do not want the chosen to reach their full potential because we know how to speak to source we know how to speak to our guys to our angels if not we're you're, you know you're close enough to getting there you're seeing the signs you're awake you're unplugged right and now you know that a lot of these things that they're using for people to make their money aren't needed right some people heal better naturally than they do from these other things and they don't want this. They don't want us to be able to change other people's lives. So they're doing their, their best to make sure that we do not reach that. Okay? And if anybody's got something negative to say, please don't even bother leaving it in the comments. Let me just tell you. I mean, what's, what's the whole point? <laughs> I just don't even see how that makes somebody feel good. I really don't. It doesn't bother me. Shoot, fly. Don't bother me. Just letting you know. It's been happening since, you know, I started my channel and it happens with everybody. But I just figured I'd put it out there. Okay. I know it's trolls, though. I know it's people that are against me. Um, because everybody who is up to light are going to have people like this. All right. Somebody could be a Pisces. You could be, they could be, it could be in your chart. You have a lot of wisdom. Your guides are saying, use it as a weapon. Okay. Study, 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 learn, 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 learn about things when it comes to your spiritual insight your spiritual um wisdom okay your gifts these are things that I, I constantly see questions about in my comments 
and a lot of the questions that I'm being asked are things that are very easily um, answered in a lot of my readings that I do. I always give you guys little things here and there, um, you know, that you guys can write down that can help you. And also other, other readers do. There's other good readers out there, right? I'm not any better than anybody. We all are special. We all have a gift and I will say that every time, okay? I was teaching you guys about clairsentience the other day. Clairsentience is when you can feel something, okay? Or when you can hold something and know it, it gives you a message, okay? That is something that a lot of us have. You'll feel like goosebumps or cold or hot when, when um, your guides or a spirit, an entity is trying to come through you can get goosebumps your hair stands up your lights flicker okay it's because they're trying to get you a message this was my topic this week for my members so if you want to join my members um that's $9.99 a month okay look it up on my channel and it will give you the information you'll get uh free readings with that okay there are many reads and they're on my lives all right guys so somebody here is trying to basically suck your energy okay when you see this it's called a aqua um oh my gosh i lost the word i know it's not an octopus i mean that's what they are but it's another word for it it'll come to me but what they do is is they have them like they they're marine something these are the ones that like to attach to you that are narcissists, spiritual narcissists. Um, they like to drain your energy, okay? You may know who this is or feel this person. This could be a father, a stepfather, an uncle, a baby daddy is what I'm getting here. Somebody is around right now. They may be in the community, in your neighborhood, unless you still live with them, okay? Okay. This person um, hears voices, but they hear it in a negative way. They have an attachment, okay? You know how you can have like a bad angel and a good angel? They have a bad angel that speaks to them, okay? This person may have like uh, schizophrenia or something, but this, come, this came with them from uh, an addiction maybe they had when they were younger. Um, or something that they did, but they definitely have some kind of attachment and it was something that they never healed. Okay. I'm picking up something about an old address. So maybe there's a trail, a hidden trail that you found at an old address, or that is where the trail is something about this. Okay. They're saying to get a mentor that can work with you, okay? Somebody that you can look up to. You can even have your guides as your mentor, okay? Meditation really does help, guys. I mention that all the time because I've been doing it a lot more, and it does help. You are dear to me. So somebody's passed on loved one has been sending them signs, synchronicities, feathers. If you found a feather... Yeah, somebody feels like you're a mystery. You're out of this world, okay? Like ET phone home. And you have a cross-watcher, somebody who's been um, cross-watching everything that you watch, okay? They could be using mirrors or they can be using devices because I have mirrors here. Um, mirrors may be your gift. Sometimes people will attack you with what you are really gifted with. So if you're being attacked with a certain item, a certain device, a lot, there may be a reason that that may be your gift like you may be very good at scrying you may be very good at, at um using mirrors what they do is they use your talent against you and that's see that's where you have to use your wisdom and find out that that's your weapon 
okay? Yeah, you're destined here. So you're destined for to learn how to use this gift. This gift is going to um, really help you. This could be clairsentience and it could be mirror magic, okay? Which mirror magic doesn't mean you're using mirrors to spy on anybody, okay? I'm telling you like to use mirrors like I use cards to get your messages. And you can basically use it to get through to the realms, okay? You don't have to use it in a negative way. Um... Some people think as soon as you say mirror, you're going to do some kind of black magic. No, okay? You can use mirrors in good ways for scrying to get messages. I'm feeling um, that you might be on the edge with this, but look more into it, right? Research it is what I'm hearing here because there's something here that's going to help you, okay? Get to where you're supposed to be. I'm hearing you are where you need to be on your path, but this is going to help you with your destiny, with your mission. Okay. I just heard you have many gifts. So that's just one of them. Chills. You could be getting chills. Okay. That's because you have a, a spirit with you. Okay. It could be a passed on loved one. It could be your guide. It could be angels. Somebody is with you trying to help you. Yep. They're helping you. You might be contemplating about something, meditating a lot, and they've been giving you answers, but you might not see it. They said that they've already given you a couple of signs. You see how there's three cups there? That is because they've been communicating with you. Source has communicated with you. Okay. Trying to lead you down the right path. Investigator. Okay. You might be very good at, at, uh, investigating at mysteries. I'm getting, I'm picking up on somebody who could be an investigator. Okay. You've gone through like a rebirth. You could be a Scorpio. Somebody could have just passed in your family or transitioned, or this could be somebody that transitioned that, um, may even be a Scorpio, but this person is trying to get through to you. They said, quiet the noise. I have a king of cups, so you could be very intuitive. Okay. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Somebody may be investigating you. Ten of cups for some kind of betrayal. Or somebody betrayed you and you're investigating them. Okay. There's definitely something being investigated here. Now, the sword is air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Queen of Wands, okay. So, this is somebody that is very religious. This person uh, could be also awake. Like, they could be going through an awakening right now. All right, let me see what this, what the Queen of Wands is coming up here for. So you could be the Queen of Wands or the King of Cups. All I know is one of you guys betrayed the other one, okay? Page of Swords. So... Yeah, their curiosity, okay? There is definitely some kind of investigation going on here because somebody feels that you did something to them or they did something to you, okay? 
but there's a lot of curiosity here in spying about how you're getting, how you've moved forward. Okay. Judgment. Yeah, because you were supposed to fall in a trap and you didn't. Somebody else ended up getting trapped. And now they're calling judgment because these they, they need to leave you be, okay? It's like a game to them. I feel like they, they, they think that they make the rules and they make the decisions because someone might always turn their head. But you know what? They don't realize source right the most high god is always watching and they're getting judged right now because they have no right to keep doing this and while they're focusing on you they're they're falling in their own traps here yeah completion this could be a baby daddy or um somebody that you may have had love for here okay lover doesn't always mean ex-lover lover could also mean somebody that you showed love for that you had love for okay but there's definitely judgment being called here they have their eyes on your next move maybe you started walking in silence right but they're being judged so they have to go to spiritual court this is not going to be fun for them. Just saying. That's why the world came out. So they're going to spiritual court. Alright guys. Peace, love, and light.